Well, Umar Johnson, uh, he said that Eminem can't be one of the greatest rappers because he's not black. Now, what's interesting is in the song with you and Eminem, We Ain't, there's a line they say, they say shit, but fuck him, Shady one of the greatest. I'm so sick and tired of this black shit, this white shit. Right. When people say that, saying that if you're white in hip hop, you can't be one of the greats. I don't agree with, uh, is it Dr. Umar? Dr. Umar Johnson. I don't agree with Dr. Umar uh, with him saying that Eminem is, is undoubtedly one of the greatest rappers ever for obvious reasons. Um, again, uh, Michael Jordan probably can't even fucking dunk from the free throw line today. So if we want to say, well, Eminem's not great today, well, motherfucking Jordan can't fucking jump from the free throw line. Yeah. So it is. We all get older, and but that doesn't mean that we don't respect or understand the the magnitude of what somebody did when they were, you know, um, at their beginning and at their peak. So Eminem is for sure, for sure, one of the best rappers ever. I don't give a fuck if he white, black, or whatever. Um, Dr. Umar is uh, seems to be pretty educated, and he also has an opinion and a, uh, a platform. So, I mean, I, I respect, uh, you know, his opinion, but I don't got to fucking agree with it. And I'm not even, I, like I said, I haven't seen Eminem in 20 years. And uh, we had our little, you know, uh, back yeah. and forth, which is all good. Um, but yeah, I'm still, it still is what it is. I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna keep it a buck. You know, I'm not gonna lie about it. Like Eminem is one of the greatest rappers of all time. He can take the sound bite, use it against me. I don't give a fuck. Like it, it is what it is. But Eminem respects me at the end of the day. If you ask him and he's going to be honest, he's going to tell you that he respects me and my pen game. He knows I'm, what, what I'm capable of. And, um, that's, that is what it is. Dr. Umar had an opinion and I don't, I don't disrespect it, but I don't agree. Well, yeah, I remember you talked about how when you guys were recording on your first album, when Eminem did his verse, he was like, what, what do you think? And you were like, what do I think? You're what Eminem. You? Like, <laughs> yeah. At that point, he was like diamond already, right? I think, yeah, I think. Uh, and the same thing happened to me when I was recording with Drake. He was just like, you fuck with it. I'm like, my nigga, you Drake. Right. Like, and Nas good. also did the same thing. With Nas you. did it. And yo, Nas, yo, Nas sat in the studio in New York with me. And he was just kind of like drinking wine and doing Nas shit. And I was like, I'm so excited to be even in the studio recording with Nas. And Nas is just relaxed. Like, he's just looking like Nas. Like, you know what I'm saying? He looking like the nigga that wrote Ether. So everybody got their thing. I was in the studio with Raekwon. And when he uh, raps, he walks in place. Uh. Walks. Like, walks. Like, it's crazy. He just, like, walks in place. But he ain't going nowhere, but he rapping. It's just like <laughs> everybody got their thing. And, uh, yeah, Eminem, like, writing in circles is some of the craziest shit I've ever seen. But it's, it, And he reads it like that when he's recording.